I'm worried about uh, climate change is, is something that is significant. Uh, on the water side, um, we rely on snowpack, and we're concerned that uh, we may not get as much snow. And if we do get snow, that it'll melt faster because our snowpack is a form of storage. And so the longer it stay uh, as snow packed up in the uh, Sierra Mountains, uh, that's great for us. But if the temperature change and it melts immediately, we don't have that storage. And so that's what we're very concerned about. We look at ways to diversify our water supply. And I think the first thing that we look at is conservation. If we have people use less, we have more to use for another day. We understand our Hetchy supply is definitely uh, a, the major source of our drinking water but we can look for alternative water supply. And so we start looking at groundwater or look at recycled water. We're starting to identify that other water su supplies can be used so that we don't have to use our drinking water to irrigate uh, our golf courses or the parks. Climate change is a big issue. I mean, it's real. It's not going away. We've already seen some of the effects of it when we look at our sewer system. If we have more of a larger storms more frequently that overwhelm our system, what does that mean? We have a lot of low-lying areas that will be susceptible to flooding, and we can't build enough infrastructure in time to capture all that. You can't capture a 100-year storm. You can try, but you just can't. So we're constantly kind of looking at this from a planning perspective, looking at, you know, what does it look like in the future? What are we going to do? What does this mean to our customers? You know, do we have to, you know, do something different now? Do we build something now? We're planning for those scenarios now, and we're starting to look at those. We're trying to figure out how that fits into our, to our future. And we'll never stop doing that. You just, you just don't.